the arrival syndrome. This is the worst thing that can happen to you. When you've arrived, everything is downhill. Yeah, yeah. You're on a downhill slide from then on. Uh, here's some manifestations of it. I know everything, so uh, there's no point in trying to teach me something new. I've arrived. <clears throat> Daniel Borstein, the historian, phrased it this way. He said, the greatest obstacle to discovering the shape of the earth, the continents, and the oceans was not ignorance. It was the illusion of knowledge. Yeah, there ain't no more. Do y'all know that uh, sometime in our checkered past in this country, uh, uh, Congress came within one boat of doing away with the uh, patent office? Everything that's been invented has already been invented. So. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, now, uh, Malcolm Forbes said the dumbest people I know are those who know it all. <laughs> so this is the worst. All right, now, here is the great uh, explanation of it. Uh, this is Sir Francis Drake's prayer before he set out to be the first man to circumnavigate the world in 1577. Disturb us, O Lord, when we're too well pleased with ourselves. When our dreams have come true because we dream too little, we arrive safely because we sail too close to the shore. Disturb us, O oh Lord. With the abundance of things we possess, we've lost our thirst for the waters of life. Having fallen in love with life, we cease to dream of eternity. And in our efforts to build a new earth, we've allowed our vi uh, vision of the new heaven to dim. Disturb us, O oh Lord to dare more boldly, to venture on wider seas where storms will show your mastery, where losing sight of land we'll find the stars. We ask you to push back the horizons of our hopes, push us in the future in strength, courage, hope, and love. This we ask in the name of our captain, who is Jesus Christ. I can't praise it any better than that. So, Keep in mind the uh, arrival syndrome and recognize it when you see that in people and avoid it in your life totally. <clears throat>